He's advising he killed her with a knife. Breaking news out of Escondido, where a man is under arrest, accused of stabbing his wife while she slept. Good evening, I'm Preston Phillips. And I'm Itika Milan. As police say the man walked into police headquarters early this morning and said he killed her with a knife. 10 News reporter Jennifer Jensen was the first to be at the scene. She is there live now with the new information we have learned about that suspect. Well, President Itika, we can tell you he has now been booked into the Vista Detention Center where he is facing first degree murder charges. Take a look behind me. You can still see this is an active scene. You can see an Escondido patrol car here at the end of the driveway and that yellow crime tape still up. This is the home where detectives still are inside the house, the same home where police were summoned to after a 67 year old man went straight to them early this morning and said he had killed his wife. This is the medical examiner's white van as it sat on the driveway of the home just after 4 o'clock, more than 12 hours after police say a 67-year-old man walked into the police station and volunteered that he had killed his wife. Escondido police confirmed there was an adult woman in her 60s who had suffered fatal stab wounds while she slept in her bed. Detectives have been at the home for most of the day. The man admitted he had killed his wife with a knife. Here's more from the early morning 911 dispatch call. Copy 1144, only no other subjects or animals. At 437, advising uh, in the master bedroom, in the bed. So back out here live again, that 67-year-old man now facing first-degree murder, murder charges. He's set to make his first appearance in front of a judge on Tuesday afternoon. Of course, we're going to continue to stay here at the scene and try to get more information about the man and the scene here from detectives. And, of course, we'll be at that court appearance on Tuesday. We are live here in Escondido. Jennifer Jensen, 10 News.